The Philippines is an archipelagic country in Southeast Asia. Despite its small size, it is one of the 18 mega biodiverse countries in the world, which include large nations like Brazil, China, India, Australia, and the United States. The current national flower in the Philippines is Sampaguita jasminium sambac, which is often used in garlands and given to tourists as welcome offerings and new graduates or competition winners as honorary symbols for their achievements. This video will showcase 20 of the most beautiful flowers which are endemic, native, or originated in the Pearl of the Orient Sea. Presenting to you the 20 most beautiful flowers that grow in the Philippines. Jade Vine, Strongylodon macrobotrys, also called emerald vine, is one of the world's rarest and most expensive plants. It was discovered on Mount Makaling in Laguna. This climber can grow up to 18 meters long and belongs to the pea and legumes family. It produces a 3 meter long cluster of claw like mint green or turquoise blooms. It displays luminous quality at night to be easily seen by the nocturnal bats that typically pollinate it. Rose Grape Although it has the common name Philippine Orchid, it does not belong to the family Orchidae. It is named in that way because it is an epiphyte or lives on trees. They can grow up to 3 meters tall. It has a cluster of pink, red, and purple blossoms. It is also named Rose Grape Metanilla Magnifica due to its small, round, purple grape-like fruits. Most Filipinos use it for ornamental purposes only. It has sweet edible berries, but people often think it's poisonous a myth. Some tribes eat not just the fruit but also its stem and leaves. It is also called the pink lantern tree, chandelier tree, love plant, and showy metanilla. Hooded Orchid There are more than 1,100 members of the family Orchidae in the nation. 900 of them are unique to the Philippines. One of the most beautiful is the hooded orchid. The local name of the hooded orchid Dendrobium aphyllum, fairy sangume, came from its resemblance to a miniature flying fairy with translucent violet wings and a yellow body lip that usually attaches to the cane-like stem. Foxtail Orchid The Foxtail Orchid Rincostalis rotusa is one of the most stunningly beautiful flowers in the world. It is named for the long inflorescence that resembles the tail of a fox and can reach up to 15 inches long. It consists of more than 100 pink-spotted white blooms. At night, when the temperature is warm, it releases a spicy aroma. There are four extant species of its genus, and all of them can be found in the archipelago. Palawan Cherry Blossom It is good news for the people who live in tropical countries and want to see the Japanese cherry blossom. This plant is almost identical to the national flower of Japan. However, they come from different families. Sakura comes from the family of plums, cherries, peaches, and almonds and lives in cold climates, while Palawan cherry blossom Cassia nodosa is from the family of legumes, peas, and beans and lives in warm climates. It is a deciduous wood. When it sheds its leaves, it is nearly white from top to bottom due to the nearly pure white pink tinged blossoms that remain on the branches. It is usually found in Palawan, Visayas, and the office of the president. Nara. Nara Terracarpus indicus is the national tree of the Philippines. Also called Amboina rosewood, Malay padok, and Andaman redwood, it can grow up to 40 meters tall. It has rose-scented, reddish hardwood usually used to make expensive furniture, houses, and wood arts. It is resistant to termites, fungi, and floods and is used in many ways, including in shampoo, herbal medicine, and tea. It has an orange-yellow inflorescence and is usually used as a source of honey. Like Cassia nodosa, it intends to shed its leaves. During the wet season, it becomes entirely yellow. Monarch Rose Mallow Monarch Rose Mallow Hibiscus radiatus is a kind of hibiscus that can grow one meter in height. It has large, trumpet-shaped, showy, mauve reproductive parts that have a fuchsia center. Its leaves are shaped similarly to those of the cannabis plant, so it is often mistaken for marijuana. The shrub is believed to be a cure for fever and is considered a blood purifier. Red Silk Cotton 
Red silk cotton bombax seba is usually found on beaches and coastal areas of the archipelago. It has cup-shaped red blooms with five petals. When it loses its foliage, it becomes entirely red and is mistakenly thought to be burning. It produces a brown oval capsule that, when ripe, contains white fibers that use for stuffing pillows and ropes. Passiflora mollucana. This is a kind of passion fruit is a climber that can grow up to 6 meters in length. It is the only type of its genus that has opposite leaves. The large reproductive part is decorated with complex patterns. It has white petals, a purple corona with white in the middle, and large green or yellow stamens at the center. It has a grenade-shaped fruit. It symbolizes the death of Jesus Christ. Queen of Philippines Queen of Philippines Macinda Philippica is a medium-sized tree reaching up to 3 meters tall. Its colors vary depending on the varieties, such as Donia Les Pink, Donia Aurora White, and Donia Evangelina Red. The pink, white, or red parts of the plant are not its flowers. It is the bracts or colored leaves that result from having no chlorophyll. The floret is orange and star-shaped and is located at the end of the cluster of bracts. It is usually used as an ornamental plant for parks and public gardens or planted along roadsides. Coral Tree the coral tree Erythrina variegata is a species of a deciduous, evergreen tree in the legume family Fabaceae. It can reach heights of up to 30 meters. The appearance of the tree is similar to that of sea corals, especially when it loses its leaves, which is where its common name comes from. Branches grow sprawlingly and are arranged similarly to hard sea coral branches. The woody structures are also covered in corky, green-gray bark with spikes, giving the appearance of sprouting coral branches and coral polyps. Flowers are showy, bean-shaped, bright scarlet or coral red, and arranged in a circular pattern. The plant begins blooming in March and continues to bloom throughout the cool and dry seasons. Water lilies. Water lilies are aquatic perennial plants of the Nymphiaceae family. They thrive in freshwater bodies of water such as lakes and ponds. Two species of water lilies are native to the Philippines. These are hairy water lily and star lotus. Rainbow eucalyptus tree. The rainbow eucalyptus tree eucalyptus deglupta, also known as Mindanao gum, is a tall colorful eucalyptus tree that can reach a height up to 150 meters. It has vertical streaks of violet, orange, blue, green, yellow, and red that run through its trunk and branches. At first glance, it appears to be an abstract painting on a tree. The coloration is caused by the pigment tannins, which are produced when the cells on the surface of the bark become age. The leaves of rainbow eucalyptus are long, leathery, and waxy, and they grow in opposite pairs. They emit an aromatic odor, like other eucalyptuses, especially when crushed. The flowers are tiny, white, or pale yellow and clustered together. They do not have petals, instead, they have a lot of long stamens which make the flowers conspicuous and appear fluffy. Joseph's Coat or Edible Amaranth The Joseph's Coat or Edible Amaranth, Amaranthus tricolor is a member of the spinach family, Amaranthaceae. This small annual shrub can grow to be 2 minus 4 feet tall. It is distinguished from other amaranths by having multicolored leaves. The leaves are simple, entire, and lanceolate oblong, and they are arranged spirally on the stem. Asters Asters are a genus of herbaceous flowering plants that belong to Theasteraceae, which also includes sunflowers and daisies. The name is derived from the Greek word for star, which refers to the shape of the bloom, which resembles a star. They symbolize patience, love, good fortune, and delicacy. The flowers, at the first glance, appear to be a single flower but they are actually a cluster of hundreds of miniature flowers. If you look closely in the yellow center disc, you will notice the tiny flowers. The large, conspicuous petals that surround the disc are known as ray florets. The color and number of ray florets vary depending on the species. The Philippines is home to two species of asters, Aster trinervius and Aster philippinensis. Atunburo's pitcher plant. Atunburo's pitcher plant Nepenthes atunburui is the world's largest carnivorous plant. It is a tall shrub that can grow up to 5 feet tall. The stem is usually prostrate or decumbent. 
The flower's description varies according to gender. Male flowers are red with no bracts, whereas female flowers are brown or purple with ovate petals. They are broad and leathery, with a specialized cup-shaped leaf, called a pitcher, on the tip of each of them. The pitcher is used as a trap for the plant's prey. It contains a liquid enzyme that aids in its victim's drowning and digestion. They have a volume capacity of up to 2 liters. Because they are so large, they can catch not only insects and other bugs, but also frogs, lizards, and small birds, as well as rodents, earning the plant the moniker Venus Rat Traps. This endangered plant is endemic to Mount Victoria on the Philippine island of Palawan. Grape-leaved anemone Grape-leaved anemone Areocapitella vitifolia belongs to the buttercup family Ranunculation is the only species of anemone found in the Philippines. It is a small plant that can only grow 1 minus 2 feet tall. It has many stems that grow from its corm, and each stem produces a large white or light purple-pink flower. Typically, the other members of its genus have round foliage, but this species has heart-shaped leaves with multiple lobes, similar to grape foliage, hence its common name. In the wild, it is found in damp open woodlands, scrublands, grasslands, and along stream banks. Paphiopetalum philippinus The Paphiopetalum philippinus is a type of Venus slipper or orchid with slipper-shaped pouches on the flower. It is relatively small in size, measuring only 8 minus 19 inches tall. It grows on the ground, but it can also be lithophytic grows on rocky cliffs or epiphytic grows on trees. Easter Lily Easter Lily Lilium longiflorum belongs to the family Liliaceae, native to Japan, Taiwan, and northern Philippines. Rafflesias Rafflesia is a genus parasitic plant in the family Rafflesia. All 28 species are native to Southeast Asia, with the Philippines hosting 13 of them. Members of this genus have no visible leaves, stems, or roots. The Rafflesia arnoldihis, the largest flower of its kind, which is roughly the size of a bicycle tire. The Rafflesia consuloi, which is endemic to Luzon Island, produces the smallest one. Because of their corpse-like odor, they have earned the nickname Corpse Lily. The odor draws FLIs and beetles, which pollinate the flowers.